So today's video is for any student who finds they need some ideas or some support to make those food and nutrition choices. My name is Amanda Kilduff and I'm the registered dietitian working for Allison Friesen Nutrition. So I have a few tips for you today going forward. Tip number one, start with breakfast. So when planning your breakfast, you want to plan three different food groups to be present. What this looks like can be even going back to the basics. So having your cereal, choosing a high fiber cereal, some milk, and a handful of almonds on top. Or some oatmeal, mix in some peanut butter, and some berries. Or it could be some whole wheat toast, two eggs, and a banana. So what's most important is that we have protein in this meal. Protein is going to keep you satisfied to get your day going and it has fiber that's going to keep you full longer. Tip number two, all about the snacks. So I know you students are at school all day, you're studying, you're in class, you may not have time to have a proper meal. So having snacks is important for when you're hungry, you need to be satisfied throughout the day. So some examples for snacks include two small yogurts and a banana. It could be cut up veggies and hummus some whole wheat crackers, and cheese slices. So these are just some examples to get you going through the day when you're hungry. And tip number three is to stay hydrated. So it's a myth that we need eight cups of water in a day. What's most important is to have water and milk most often to quench your thirst. So staying hydrated is important. It's gonna keep you energized throughout the day. So it's best to bring a water bottle with you, sip on it throughout the day, and drink more during meals and snacks. So these are my tips for you. Thanks for listening, and I hope it helps you going forward.